Well, good morning, beloved. This is your girl Sharon once again from my front seat. And here we are giving God all praise, honor, and glory for what you say, beloved, for this brand new day. Well, today is Friday. Today is June 3, 20 and 22. And here we are giving God all praise, honor, and glory for what you say, beloved, for this brand new day. So we are here. I am coming to you from my front seat. However, my front seat a little later by way of the driveway. So I moved to the city of San Bernardino five years ago and I would drive back and forth to work. Then I began taking the bus. I'd drive to Montclair, get on the 699, go into downtown, blah, 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 da, da, da. So then I was off work for a couple of years. I had surgery and then I went back to work this past June and I was taking the Metrolink. Enjoyed it, right? Uh, drive in every now and then, but for the most part, taking the train. Well, by the time I went back to work, uh, you know, there in the during the pandemic, I went through my retraining, and then they were like, "You can take calls from home." Well, I did not take them up on that offer, right? So uh, a friend I started work with, uh, she was soon to retire. She's like, oh, Sharon, take calls from home when I retire. So she officially retired this past Friday. And so um, I start started last week or this week getting set to take calls at home. So today I'll be taking calls from home. Now the word of God lets us know that we are overcomers by two things. What? The blood of the lamb, the words of our testimony. So I give God the glory. So as you know, uh, just recently, the Lord God blessed us to close escrow on a home. It was 85 day escrow, but we closed by the grace of God. We made it across that finish line. I thank God for Jesus. So um, in taking the train, I'm up at 2.30, leave at 3.30, catch the train at 4.11 a.m., back home about 6, 6.30, just depends on the train ride. So, um, now I get to sleep till five, but the testimony, so God has blessed us with a home and there's a bedroom set up as the office. So that's where I'll be working from where I was spending $70 a week on a round trip ticket fare, um, I'm going to see if I can put that in my savings account now. God has blessed so I can live in my home, enjoy my home. Um, I'll be working from home as of this morning. I got up this morning at 5. I talk with Jesus. I exercise, grow with Joe. She has a gospel video. I did that. Um, I've been kind of slow poking around, but I'm going to get in. I start work at seven. So just great things God has done. And I'm so thankful to God uh, that he's faithful. I'm so thankful to God that he never forgets as my auntie, cousins, God, sister, big sister, Lisa Wise, always Lisa Alice Wise, Hartfield, always remind us. God never forgets. So I still got some stuff in my car because my husband was like, Sunday, we finishing up this apartment, Sharon. So I had to just throw some stuff in my car and I've been taking it out in the evenings when I come home little by little, but we'll see if we'll have more time now. But I just wanted to share with you the blessings of the Lord. And so today I began working from home. I'll be working from home for as long as I'll be working from home. And I give God the glory. So let me get out of this car, go inside, get myself set up and get ready. So this is your girl Sharon. And when I enter into that office space in my bedroom or in the other bedroom, I'm going to render unto Caesar those things which belong unto Caesar. And all the while I'm I'm going to be giving God the praise, honor, and glory. This your girl, Sharon. I'm out, y'all. Deuces.